Hey everybody, welcome to Technology and Toys, and today's video is going to be an unboxing and review of iMuto's Taurus X6L Pro Smart Power Monster, and this thing does live up to its name. It's a 30,000 milliamp hour high capacity power bank. It's got a lot of bells and whistles to go with it, which we'll cover in this video. Just to give you an idea of how much this is, it charges the 12 inch MacBook two and a half times, the iPhone 8 11 and a half times, the iPhone 7 12 full times, the iPad Air three times, Galaxy S7 seven times, the Note 5 seven times, and the Nexus 6P six times. So let me uh, open this up real quick. We're greeted with a thank you card. Details on uh, how to leave a review. And then you get a little booklet on what the battery is and what it does in like 12 different languages. We're gonna move this off to the side. Under this little flap, we get two things. We get a USB-A to micro USB cable to charge it up. It is iMuto branded, so that's pretty cool. And you also get, I can get it out of the box, an iMuto branded micro USB to USB type C adapter. So if I were to just stick that on there, now I can charge this using USB C. And yes, you can do that. And then under the cardboard, you get a nice big carrying pouch to hold it in. Always a fan of when really anything includes a carrying pouch, it's nice. Let's take this out of its little plastic baggie here. Put the baggie and the literature back in here. Move that off to the side. And here is the X6L Pro itself. This is a very chunky battery. This is 21.8 ounces compared to, uh, do, I, do I actually have it somewhere? Here it is. This is 21.8 ounces compared to the about 16 ounces of the X4 or X4L or whatever they have named it now. It's fairly taller. Sides are fairly similar. Still have your micro USB port to charge it. But on the top is where it gets a little different. Um, on the older ones you had two USB ports and a flashlight. And then on the new one you still have those two USB ports. One of them supports Qualcomm Quick Charge 3.0. And then where the flashlight was, you have a USB Type-C in and out port. You can charge the battery through this port. You can also charge other devices through this port. Um, and I've been using this with my MacBook Pro and it does charge the MacBook Pro. So I've got a bunch of uh, cables off to the side of my set over here. And I'm gonna take a micro USB cable, Blackberry branded, oh, that's an old cable. Plug it in and it starts charging, and then I plug in to the USB-C port. It does start charging this. I'm gonna take a lightning cable, I plug it into the power bank, I grab my iPhone, I plug it in, it starts charging, plug it into the other port, it's charging, and then I don't have a Type-C to lightning cable, so I can't Keep going with my iPhone. But I do have a Type-C to Type-C cable that I use to charge my MacBook. So I'm going to plug that in. I'll move that off to the side and I'll take my MacBook out. And I'll plug in the MacBook and it starts charging. Now I don't know exactly how many times this will charge the 13 inch MacBook Pro. You can realistically charge anything with this battery. Tablets, phones, laptops, headsets, anything. You can charge anything with this battery, and I believe you can charge up to three devices at the same time using these three ports. So I've been using this for a little over a week. It's been my main daily driver battery, um, and it took the place of my Hokanui and the old iMuto battery, and I've been using this solely for the past week-ish, and I've had absolutely no issues with it. It's lasted me all week, all week, and I'm the kind of guy that's on his phone all the time, on the MacBook all the time, killing batteries left and right, having to charge them up and kill them and charge them and kill them, and this lasted me 
all week last week and I still had 20% left. It does take a while to charge the battery because there's a lot in here. I think that's why they included the quick charge port so it goes a bit quicker. Uh, but it's really not that big of a problem. If you plug it in overnight, you go to bed, you wake up, It's if it's not fully charged, it's somewhere in the high 80s and up. And even, even that should be able to last you for a week or more. This thing is rather pricey. Just prepare yourself. This is rather pricey. Um, but personally, I do believe that what you're getting with this battery is worth the price. It's about $60 on Amazon right now. For those of you that do research or are looking into this and have seen iMuto's other products, you might be saying, but Jake, the X4 costs 30 bucks and you're getting two thirds of what the X6L Pro has to offer. And you are right. But for that extra 20, 30 bucks, you're getting 10,000 milliamp hours more. You're getting a USB-C port, which can charge absolutely anything on the planet. You're getting Qualcomm Quick Charge 3.0 supported on this USB port. And then to charge the device up, it is charged through Quick Charge 3.0. So for the size of the battery and the technology that you're getting in this package, personally, I would still go up the extra 20, 30 bucks over the X4 and get the new one because it will last me longer. Because like I said, I'm the guy that will kill his batteries multiple times per day and have to charge them multiple times per day and this lasts all week and more. So just from a return on investment point of view, if you have the ability to shell out the 60-ish dollars for this and you know you're going to use it, get it. 100% recommended. If you're questioning it, get it, use it, try it. If you don't like it, I'm sure you can return it to Amazon. The link to check it out will be down in the description below. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications so that way you get notified when the next video goes live. This has been Jake with Technology and Toys. Until the next video, guys, I'll see you later. Goodbye.